Oh, snap. Also, it's off of double blind again. Oh. I, how and when did that happen, exactly? In in his spare time, Garcia loves to play uh, string instruments. In fact, there's some old posts of Garcia actually uh, posting videos of himself. But knowing Garcia, I don't even know if he like took someone else's video and pretended <laughs> <laughs> to be a like, like, I don't even know. Okay, well. That's quite an obscure metaphor there. I, I think they're intentionally not making any sense at this point. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. snap! Burn! <laughs> Chess just descended into madness. <laughs> that's fine. <laughs> Those that's air fun. horns. <laughs> that's, that's when you know it's too hype. <laughs> People are getting really excited over Nasdaq burns. I love air horns <laughs> as long as they're not five feet from my ears. <laughs> like in a stadium. Oh, dude, so this reminds me of this story. I didn't have the guts to do it, but, like, my friend, he had a, he had a freaking air horn, and we had just finished our last exam, and we're walking through the hallway, and he goes to his locker, and I don't even know what... I didn't know at the time. I thought it, he was just getting his stuff because we were going to go go to his house after and, like, play video games. But I, before I knew it, I'm a freaking accomplice to his crime. Pull an air horn out and blast it right down the hall. <laughs> and I'm like, oh shit, now I'm in trouble too. <laughs> and just like just, the most rossable thing. He just freaking ran as fast as I could. Anyway, back to the match. <laughs> we are, uh, we're seeing a super block or super dodge against super dodge here. That's right. It, yeah, it's probably gonna happen. There's and uh, there's a uh, ace dodge for DeGray right there. Yeah, and DeGray also starts off with a ten throw. Yep. Of all things, immediately goes down to uh, low hand. <laughs> yeah. Which again, DeGray, one of the few characters that can really uh, leverage that to be a positive thing. Hashtag Yomi, hashtag wrecked. <laughs> so yeah, one of... Some would say Lum is a careful accountant, but I still think Lum has a fair amount of elements of randomness. Yeah, I mean, I, yeah. I've heard the, yeah, the debates about what his personality really is. Like if he's actually like a gambler, or maybe he's like just feigning it, and he's actually like this really calculating mastermind. Right. Mastermind Panda. I mean, look at his Joker. <laughs> he's got glasses in his Joker. And they're not just any glasses. Those are like freaking Scrooge McDuck <laughs> glasses. Yeah, he actually does wear glasses in his other pictures. Yeah. Maybe? Like, look at his Jack. Yeah, and his, uh... Those are like evil anime villain glasses. Look at his normal attacks. Oh, so he does. The truth is revealed. Yeah, they're just sort of hard to see in some cases. And I don't I don't see them on his uh, cartwheel attack. Dude, because they fell off. Yeah, exactly. And, the <laughs> <laughs> and they're just uh, sideways on his block and his throw, basically. Maybe he is like Scrooge McDuck. I mean, he's probably rich at this point, right? Right, that's why you can afford to throw yeah. coins at people. <laughs> Giant, Jesus, really. massive frisbee coins. <laughs> Look at that thing. That's, that thing's got to be worth like a million dollars. And he recurs them, so he, he throws like ten of them a game. <laughs> yeah. Lum really is gambling real money when he plays, because yeah. when he throws his game, he doesn't know if he's going to get it back. <laughs> right. It might just be lost. Oh, huge damage here from uh, a seven throw. That's a thing. DeGray, DeGray can win combat. Like, he's got a bunch of cards that just win combat straight up. <laughs> I play the I win card. 
but uh not that they win they have a really high chance to win but generally when you have a really high chance to win you can't do much damage like dragon punches dodges well, don't usually have much damage on them but degray degray can play cards with a high chance to win and high damage for example ace dodge for example king with moral high ground for example seven through you see the joker getting used so now lum has a very large hand but is still losing quite a bit in the life metric i mean probably because he has such a very large hand well yes it's all it's all related uh, and there's well, some more big damage of. i don't think garcia has really been winning combat I, 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 no, he has not. Yeah. That, <laughs> that too, but he wouldn't be losing by as much if he had less cards. Right. If he had played dodges instead of blocks. Yeah. yeah. I mean, we just saw that king do 17 damage. Right. And Garcia cannot get a jackpot to land. I mean, jackpot's still not exactly very likely. What was it that turn? Yeah, only one ace, so 25%, and actually he had 25% chance to hit a joker there, which he didn't hit either. More blocking, super big hand. Yeah, 12 cards. I, I assume yeah. he has a plan to for, for some of this to make a poker flourish. I mean, he's yeah, there we go. He's going to power those oh, wow. up. Yeah, I think he was actually waiting on a straight flush because he has two, three, four of clubs. Really? But he says, he says, I'm running out of health. This freaking degree. I don't think I'm I've just, ever seen a straight flush. I'm just gonna happen. do. Yeah, I've, I've never seen, seen it a few flush times. Um, I think Garcia and Deluxe are some of the best people I've known for paying attention to straight flushes. Like sometimes I've commentated them and they are making a straight flush and I didn't even know it because I didn't even play them. And I was like, why do you do this? It's kind of <laughs> weird. But what's happening is he's setting up the straight flush. And uh, this could be game. Might not get a chance to really take advantage, yeah. But uh... Yeah, he, does, the, he can't follow up with anything, actually. Oh, so the bluff was unnecessary, but... For him, it was worth it. Okay, so uh, now we got aces, aces, and aces, and three poker flourishes in hand. So uh, Garcia could actually turn this around really quickly. Yep, so Too that... bad, can't dodge. So notably, four of a kind is not straight flush, though, unfortunately. That's right. Why is the panda sideways? <laughs> <laughs> oh wait, Kadir is, Kadir is another. Another Garcia-like fellow. <laughs> Caragir. So, uh, Garcia goes with the 10 block. Double block. It all works out. He gets to keep his 10. <laughs> I mean, he's got so many 10s that I think he's not super worried if he lost one. More worried about getting thrown and losing the game. Because <laughs> of his health. So let's see. Does Garcia play attack ace? Does he play dodge ace? Does he throw Wolf with the looks 10? Like, looks like dodge ace. Dodge ace does not work. On again. Is it over? Does I think... Gray have a card this time? I wasn't looking, but I'm gonna bet on it. One card, which is all he needs. He does seven damage? Yeah, he's got a dagger fall. Oh damn, lucky guy. Boom! I mean, That's he would gain. He gains six damage just off of his passive. Yeah, it does right. way more than he needs it to. <laughs> Boom! But like, there aren't, there aren't and there aren't too many cards he could have drawn that killed there. Could have drawn his seven. Could have drawn a jack or a king, or another ace, which would be ace ace. 